Brian Brown, thanks for taking the time. Congratulations. Four wins, two losses, a uh, lot of water polo over the weekend. How'd your team hold up? Were they ready physically for playing four or six games in that many days? Yeah, it was tough. It was a it was a great weekend overall, overarching, fantastic weekend. Um, but yeah, we were we were testing ourselves mentally and physically. Um, no, we weren't ready, so that was part of our conditioning, part of our working out, if you will. Um, but the mental side was great, and our guys handled it perfectly. Um, all that we could ask for, we put ourselves in a couple tough situations. Some we won, some we lost, um, but nonetheless, we grew from it, and I think that's the most important part. Seemed to me watching some of the games that uh, you you forced a lot of teams to to take some exclusions. You forced them into doing that, and then you made them pay for it. Did you did you like what you were doing on the special teams at least? Uh, yes and no. Um, some days, some situations, yes. Um, you know, a couple situations um, overall throughout the game, you'd say we did a poor job. And if you look at the overall, how we did on six on five. Um, but on top of that, there was a couple situations, key moments in games. You need that goal. You need that s momentum switch. And we got those, especially like in the Wagner game. We scored one right before half to tie the game. And then we scored down the stretch our six on five, which is the most important. Um, so, yeah. So, yes and no. <laughs> you look at the stats right now. You have the top two scorers in the nation. I think everybody knew Grant Snyder would be there. But 29 goals, that's, that's pretty good over six games. Games. Yeah, I mean, Grant's a phenomenal player. I mean, every team's going to know that. Every team already knows that. Um, yet he's still able to do some wonderful things. Um, but yeah, I know I didn't know that about the top two scores until um, just now. Um, but uh, you figured Grant was going to be up there somewhere and will be there throughout the season. Um, he's a fantastic, wonderful player. And, you know, credit to everybody, not only him, but credit to the team for getting in the ball, finding the situations as well. So. I think watching the games as well, I mean, I expected Grant Snyder to score goals, but you had a lot of people score a lot of goals. Were you excited at, at seeing different people put it in the back of the net? Absolutely. You know, our young kids played really well, um, got goals right away in the beginning of the games and stuff, which, which helps. Um, and then, yeah, everybody was scoring goals. Everybody was up there. Um, so it was really nice to see the team come together and a lot of successes for a lot of people. So this coming weekend, you go on the road again to play an awful lot of water polo again. Is this just part of the conditioning treatment, or what do you want to see from your team this weekend? Well, obviously, there's places to grow, right? I mean, we're not perfect by any means. we got more plays to implement, more situations to implement. Uh, we got to get better at certain things. we got to continue to do the things we did well over the weekend. we got to continue those situations as well. So a lot of growing mentally. Um, but yeah, these first tournaments and stuff, it's all about conditioning and getting ready for later in the season. Um, but yeah, lots of reps, lots of situational stuff. Um, I hope that we grow mentally over this week and through the weekend. Also helps with the team attitude, right? I mean, you could come out of that week and go, hey, we're pretty good. Or you can come out of that week and say, eh, we got a lot to work on. What do you think your players are thinking? Um, I think they were surprised at where they were and the su success that we did have. Um, I think there was. I think they might have thought it was going to be closer, um, but I think the success we had made it really good um, to realize, hey, where we're at and where we need to go. So I think they understand. I've made it pretty clear. Like season's not over. We got lots of games left. We got lots of improvement to do. Um, so I think I've made that pretty clear. So I think everybody's on board of, hey, how can we get better? We got four fantastic teams this next weekend. Um, they're all going to be close games, tight battles. Um, so once again, we're putting ourselves in situations where we have to grow. Ryan Brown, thanks for the time. Good luck this weekend. Appreciate it, Brian.